Today I'm at the American Association for the Advancement of Science offices uh, talking more about how social media can connect scientists and the public as part of my Churchill Fellowship. And I think one theme that's starting to come out of the discussions that I'm having is that around community. So communities around the researcher, communities about, around the research that's taking place, but also the community in which the researcher is working. And I think that's one thing that's really becoming important about how that is managed and how big the community is um, can determine if it's the researcher that's taking that forward themselves or if it needs to be an external person or body that is helping them manage that relationship. I think I first started speak, thinking about this when I was talking to Marissa about the crowdfunding project and how that instantly creates a community around the work that's taking place because you've got Marissa as the researcher but then you've also got the people that have invested in that project um, and that creates a network there of sharing, sharing of ideas through that one project. But it gets a bit more complicated if you've got a large research group with lots of different partners because how is that represented and how can people engage with the public about that work? Does everyone do it separately? How does it all come together as one kind of effort? effort? And I think that's where the role of community, either community managers or engagement practitioners can come into the group to help facilitate that. That could be helpful but it also could bring up lots of problems because it provides a gap between the researchers and the public audience. So there's lots of questions about that that I'm thinking about today. Um, this afternoon I'm going to be speaking to the public engagement team here at AAAS, so I'm looking forward to that. Um, I've written a blog post about my time at Yale and about how engagement can happen through a university museums or working closely with museums and also about some of the work um, PhD students and researchers are doing at Yale to enhance their own skills in public engagement and organising their own public events as well. Um, so that was great and I've linked to that below.